Let's pretend Ooh. that we're walking I, normally. Yeah, let's in, uh, in den time. Let's, <laughs> let, let's go. Hold on a second. Let me let me talk about some of the repairs here, and that way people, when they're looking, they can they can see that we are. I don't know if it's trying to. Hopefully, yeah. yeah. I don't know why it's not letting me uh, get the focus on that, but we should be able to get that. No, 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 no. Okay. So that's a significant yeah. crease right there. All right. So let me take a look at this one. So what we're doing, ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us, what we're going to be doing is we're going to use uh, certain tools to uh, work these creases out. We've got a, a zigzaggy horizontal crease, and then we've got a vertical crease on the other side. Um, these are advanced, these techs, uh, most of them know what they're doing here, and some of them are just trying out the new technique. This is going to be the glide and slide technique that Jared's going to be using for this and Mario is going to be using a uh, a snake tool for this right here so and what he's going to be doing is uh, going across making contact across that dent yeah yep just like that can I turn that down just a second just a little bit here it's just a tiny bit here I don't know why I can't it won't focus for me yeah can we, can we turn the, the light down a little bit? Should have a dimmer right there, right? Sorry guys, it's just, there, there you go. Yeah, that's perfect, yeah, that's good. It gives me more of a, uh, of the look here. All right, mm -hmm. so. So what he's doing is he's taking just a little bit of a slide and glide. He's tracing the, uh, that crease out. Look at that. What's up, Dino? Got a cool cat right there, man. Good job, Jared. Dino might already know this technique, but what he's doing is using a nylon rounded tip and he's just gliding the pressure off of that right there. I might get interrupted here. We got Mexico in the house. We got Colombia actually here in the house with us directly. Mario and Jared is from Arizona. Good job, Jared. So before I miss too much action, we're gonna come over to Mario. Let's see how he's working this crease out with this snake tool. And what it's doing is it's, it, he's making contact with that tool straight on the sharp edge. And he's, what he's able to do is make that crease super clean, get it out super clean. It's deep. It's a deep, it's a deep crease. Sharp crease. How do you like that tool, Mario? I absolutely like it. Precise uh, pushes. I can get the center out more easily. So, getting used to it. Yeah. But uh, it will help you to be more efficient to get this type of damage. Yeah. So, yeah, I like it. Perfect. Let's see it. See, come down here, and then here's some of the option tools that we're we're using here. Um, this is the slide and glide tip right there. Okay, it's a Johnson from Ultra. Um, this is a stand liner tool that you could use down the line, but using the tip of it. He could be using uh, the saber tooth tool right here for some finished work. You've got the crane here. You've got the double bend pick, which is the, one of the most ultimate finishing tools. 
uh, on the market. You got the straight pick here. And you got ants and stuff too as well. And then this is the straight, this is the straight crane. So really good. Yeah, getting some of that depth out of there, right there. Very good. Look at, I can close my eyes here, dude. Mario's already getting some of this out here. So that's a very sharp crease. Very smooth, dude, huh? Absolutely. It's super. Can you pull that 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 tool out? Let me see that. So that's the tip he's using, guys. That's it. Right there, directly on the sharp part. Dino says you're killing it, dude. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Dino. <laughs> you know who Dino is? Uh, I'm not sure. But... Y'all, you, you, you all know him? Dino's, Dino's PDR. He's on Instagram a lot, posting like crazy. Absolutely. He's Latino. All oh, right. So yeah. He's so. Uh, he's a brother. <laughs> oh yeah, he's he's one of the coolest guys in in the industry. So, yeah, look at that. So you got that thing halfway out already, pretty much, dude. Yep. He's still got a tiny bit of cleanup to do, but this is called the pass, right? He's, got, he's mm -hmm. doing a nice pass he's through it. Pass. Okay, we'll check on Jared. I'll check on Jared. I'll come back to you. Don't be taking that den out when I'm not looking. All right. <laughs> so in case you guys are, you know, we're, we're here at the shop. This is my shop here. Uh, this is where I do PDR training. And uh, it's pretty open, pretty clean. And we work all the way around the car, uh, just fixing dents and making sure that uh, we're using different techniques, different tools. Right now he's using a VIP tap down. I just kind of give you some insight, bird's eye view. This isn't my polished videos where everything's edited and looks pretty. And, and it's for the impatient people that want to see just nothing but just big smashes. But the small details is where it's at right here. So he's got it brought up. He's trying to go for that. That uh, uh oh, he's going for the pick action. To the pick. Now you like the pick. Now for why do you like the pick? Uh, I like it because it's really accurate. It's real soft push for how accurate it is. Yeah. And you would think it'd be like real sharp and aggressive and just get really smooth pushes. Yeah. That's a... Okay, go for it, dude. Yo, I'll come back to you because you know what? Mario's probably over here already finish? trying to finish this thing out. I know what you're trying to do, dude. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I was trying to get that light out of your, out of your face here. Now, if in case you're wondering about the LEDs, these are LEDs. This light in particular is from Limident Light. So he's got cool, warm, cool, on. By the way, which reflection are you using, Mario? I mean, which color are you looking at? I'm looking at the cold one. The cold, the... Yeah. The, the white. The white. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Now, if you guys haven't had a chance, go check out inst the Instagram, my Instagram on Dent Time. You'll see this gnarly, deep, a Dent Olympic dent that we put in. It's really stretched dent. Um, so go check it out over there on the IGTV, and you'll see what what we're doing here, what we've been we're working fun. with. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're having fun second day of the advanced and uh, it's only going to get funner absolutely good deal look at that okay jared let's see how it's going dude yeah, i got most of the depth up yeah now i'm doing another yeah go ahead and tap down knockdown yep
higher than the bird's eye view. So he's using VIP on that. Look how clean that's getting pushed out, dude. Ladies and gentlemen, I know it's not, that seems super action-packed, but I'm telling you right now, to push a crease this clean is very, very hard if you don't have the right tools or the technique. Because generally what happens is that any traditional pushing, you leave poke marks or stitching mm -hmm. and then it, it's it's it yeah, takes a ton to clean up takes a lot of time you waste a lot of time cleaning up at the end very good jared Mara is from Colombia. Jared is from Arizona. Super clean. Good. Dang, dude. Jared's what he's doing is just pushing just a little bit of the lows out what he's trying to do and just pinpoint the rest okay pinpoint with that pick how you like that pick dude love it you still using it yep yeah works really yeah. well look at his leverage his leverage is further out than he's reaching and actually it's about it's about 50 50 so that's good yeah gives him about 50 50 push he's not losing the leverage he's comfortable right yeah you don't feel like you're having to struggle to push with it, right? No, not at all. Yeah. Especially being closer to that, yeah. I'd rather yeah. not. So some of the tools, that's, a, that's an ultra, we'll get to that in a second. He's using stand liner tools. I'll take you over here just to give you a little insight here. Thanks, Dino. These are some of the uh, stand liner tools that we use. Uh, different variations of them, obviously. Uh, here's the hook tools from the, these are the whale tail hook tools, door hook tools from Blam. Uh, killer whale tails, different versions, uh, Dent Reaper stuff. Actually, we're gonna be using Dent Reaper. More Dent Reaper stuff too as well. And then this one right here is a This here is the um, Anson drawer where we have sharper tools, door lords, sharps, door lord uh, blades. And 
And then this gentleman is almost done. So in case you just joined us, there was probably what, a six inch crease there? Yeah. Or six inch deep. And step over here to this part of the office and we've got um, variations of, of uh, ultra stuff here. Some more stand liners. Um, some Dent Reapers. This is, you've probably seen me do a little bit of a review on this one right here, on uh, last video. And some of the videos I do are polished, some of them aren't, or some of them are live like this one, okay? Uh, these are some of my blending hammers that I've been using. I usually keep them pretty organized, but I've been getting so many that you really, I just don't have the room to organize them in this area. So this is probably one of the most interesting Harry Potter blending hammers right here. See, this really is a blending hammer, too. So this is the tip. This is a more of a precise tip that you can be push, uh, tapping with. And then it's the more blunt side right there. Um, but they're all actually, all of these hammers are actually pretty good. Really good. Um, and this is my little tool cart that we use. You've probably seen me talk about this on, a, on another live video, T-Stack. Good job, Mario. You, you know what? You just might make it, dude. You just might make it, bro. Good job. Okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is this is uh, real training right here. What we do is I guide them and then I let them try the tools and see how clean they can get it out. And that is the purpose right there. You can see Jared's just got a little bit of tapping and some pushing. It's, it's, it's a little back and forth battle. Jared is only a one year tech, only a one year tech, dude. How good were you at one year, you veteran techs? We, we, we sucked, I'll tell yeah, you that, we dude. We sucked really bad. Exactly. Okay, guys, well, my name is Mike Toledo. Thanks for watching. Hey, listen, I am going to be posting some more videos. Stay tuned for that. I've got a longer video coming out uh, just showing a really smashed uh, oil canned save. So that'll be out soon. I'll talk to you guys later. Say what's up, Mario. See ya. What's up, everyone? There's Jared. So see one. you guys.